with. Welcome to my world. Hi, my name is Yvette Fuentes and this is my channel called Multiverse. And what I want to do today is that I want to tell you about how I got interested in studying physics. So um, when I was a little girl, I was a pretty bad student. I didn't get very good grades and I wasn't really very interested in school. I liked to play out in the garden, I liked to play in the roof of my house, it was not very um, safe. I liked to um, dance, ballet and sing and things like that. And my father always uh, gave me scientific toys, so he would give me a telescope, a microscope, a magnet set, a chemistry set, and I just threw them all into the closet, never played with them. And I just put up my skates and went and, and skating in the, in the street and so on. So my parents uh, thought that I would never become a scientist. My dad loved science and he was always trying to um, encourage my brother and I to be interested in it. So for example, at lunchtime we would get together and he would tell us about the Big Bang or some interesting topic like that. And there was a show by Carl Sagan called Cosmos and we used to watch it together. And that really inspired me. I loved the way that Carl spoke. I loved that he was in some beautiful scenery in a nice building, something like that, with really nice classical music. And then he would talk about um, the universe and so on. And he did it in such a way that it was so inspiring. And I think that really touched me. And also, my dad would take us, for example, to the beach, and then we would go uh, down to the ocean and we would look at the stars and I could feel that same passion in my dad so I think that's really what inspired me then later on I saw Star Wars and I remember that um, I think I was nine and we came out of the cinema my brother who's seven jumped out of the cinema with his face totally transformed and shouted I am Luke Skywalker so it's kind of a bit funny because I couldn't like really identify that well, well maybe with Princess Leia, but what I remember is that I really, really, really wanted to be in a spaceship more than anything on this planet. And then in my 20s I got interested in Star Trek and I was thinking that it was really funny that I was quite old then and I still felt this sort of burning <laughs> desire of being on a spaceship. Um, so the other day I was with one of my postdocs and he said, um, uh, no, I told him, you know what, um, superconducting circuits are sensitive to space-time distortions. And then he answered, yes, that's like the relativistic effects that we found in quantum teleportation. And I started to laugh because I realized that, well, I'm definitely not in a spaceship, but I do definitely speak at work as if I was in, uh, in the Enterprise or something like this. So that's quite funny. Um, Anyway, I think there's a lot more to say about why I decided to become a physicist, but I'll tell you the story in another video slowly, because I don't want to make videos too long. And I think um, this is starts with, with that for a bit. So I'm going to end the video here. And by the way, I want to say that my son Leo is now helping me with the videos. He's doing editing. He made a very nice intro for my channel and so on. So I'd like to thank him 